Hey guys, so we're out here at Carlisle Ford Nationals and we're about ready to get started with the first competitor of our little dyno competition. That's right, we're doing a mini Mustang Mayhem here at the Ford Nationals. You guys might remember we did something similar back at our shop. But this time around we have three cars, something for everybody, a twin screw car, twin car, and also a big single car. And we're going to see who's putting down the most power. The winner's going to take home a nice little gift card from American Muscle. The $150 gift card from American Muscle. And our second and third place guys are going to get $50 gift cards to American Muscle just for coming out, hanging out, strapping their cars down. So we're about ready to get started here, so let's get this thing on the road. I'm here with Kyle Hout and his 2011 GT. Kyle, why don't you tell me a little bit about what you got going on under the hood? All right, so I got a 2.3 liter Ford Racing Whipple Supercharger. Uh, running on 10 PSI, I have a 123 millimeter JLT intake, ID 1000, I have full exhaust, headers back. Um, power wise, probably expecting somewhere about maybe 570 to about 590 ish. All right, you guys heard it 570 to 590. I'd say those are pretty fair numbers, so stay tuned and see what it puts out. <laughs> All right, so this car landed right in the middle of that power range that we were talking about earlier with Kyle, between 570 and 590. He ended up making 581. Not too bad, considering pretty much a stock motor, Whipple yeah. car, I mean, that's commendable for sure. But up next, we have Chuck coming up with his twin turbo Coyote. We're gonna go talk to him, see what kind of power he's making. Guys, we're here with Chuck, the second car of our Mustang Mayhem. Now, the first car just got off the dyno, laid down 582 at the rear wheels. So, Chuck, you're here with your 2012 GT. We got the twin turbo kit going on. Tell us a little bit more about the setup. Uh, well, it's an on three twin turbo kit. Uh, got one, one piece drive shaft on it. Some, uh, some miscellaneous visual mods. Very to go cool. With it. Well, it's clean, man. It looks good. Uh, now, power expectation wise, what are you thinking? Um, it's made 600 before, so I'm just hoping I can meet that again. Chuck's twin turbo Coyote just finished up here on the dyno where it laid down an event leading currently 615 rear wheel horsepower. Sounded gnarly on the dyno, especially with those cutouts wide open. I think it sounded great. Yeah. It sounded super aggressive, really strong. I love turbo cars, don't you? Who doesn't? And speaking of turbo cars, where do you guys see what's coming up next? We got Al Davis coming through with his big single turbo Coyote powered uh, GT. Built motor, should be a crowd pleaser. All right, guys, third car of the event here, Al Davis. Tell us about the setup. Oh, the setup is a Justin Performance uh, JPC uh, Racing uh, 76 Turbo Single. Can you give us an idea what we're going to be seeing on the dyno here with this thing? We're looking for four numbers. Uh oh. So <laughs> let's go for the big four. Let's tune it up. We're at, we're at Carlisle. We're with American Muscle. Let's get it done. Well, Stephanie, our third and final car for Mustang Mayhem here at Carlisle just finished up, and wow, I mean, that thing was pretty rad, right? It was super impressive. I mean, the car made, what did it make? It made... 845. It made 845 downshifting and spinning tire on this mobile dyno that we got here. We know the car has more in it, uh, but you know what? It is what it is. They only give us one run here. It's super impressive power. It's a street car, too. Absolutely. Glass roof, the whole nine yards, AC. So Al's a good sport, though. He's going to bring his car back out to our show, Maple Grove, August 15th. And rumor has it, he's gonna run against some of our very own AM race cars. Should be fun to watch. So guys, again, subscribe to our YouTube channel if you wanna see that matchup, I know you do. And that's gonna wrap us up here for Mustang Mayhem, Carlisle 2015.